Yo, do da day. Do da, do da. like to show y'all something I made it up here to Elk Mountain to park when it's all prep but on the video if y'all remember this truck here he was parked right here in front of me we parked there was no wind there was nothing on this ramp in about 15 minutes after we parked I mean the wind has been rocking my truck all night long I have hardly gotten any sleep but this is what this guy did to try to keep from his trailer from flipping over he actually backed up and put his trailer into the ground over here off the ramp so that it's not you know sideways against the wind to try to you know put it into the wind not against the wind so it wouldn't flip over because of course you know he's a lot lighter I'm loaded with you know 43,000 pounds in the box and I'm still rocking. To be on the safe side, I actually dropped my airbags on the trailer and on my tractor just to keep me low to the ground while I'm sitting here. Let's see if you can see. I don't know if you can notice how he's rocking. But now we're gonna put my camera here in the holder. Well, you can't really tell because I guess stabilization is on the camera, but I'm rocking pretty freaking good. I mean, it has been rocking non-stop out of here, but the good thing is I'm still seeing trucks come by, so I know, hey, once my 10-hour breaks up, I'm going and I'm rolling because trucks are still rolling, so I guess as long as we're loaded, we're good. And that's what I was worried about. Is, am I going to see trucks when I wake up? see trucks rolling across through here so like I say they lifted the the wind advisory here last night um, it just gave strong winds but it didn't say the mountain was shut down for um, between here and Walcott it didn't say it was shut down to trucks that are light and high profile but that did come back on and it says it's on until 8 o'clock tonight which it is now Saturday night so, <coughs> this was my day, y'all. I still have an hour and a half before I can <coughs> get up and roll. I just, I can't leave yet. The wind has had me up for quite a while. Thor has been up crying all night long because I guess this has really disturbed him. With us rocking, you can hear the truck creaking. When the rock has been pretty bad. So he's been pacing the truck, coming back, laying up on my head. He'd come back up front, he'd come back, he'd lay on my head. You know, want that, I guess, safety and comfort. But anyway, we did have a good visit with the clutch trucker, y'all. Um, so, I thought that was cool. He came and he picked me up. I mean, we had a really good visit. I enjoyed meeting him. I enjoyed checking out the truck. It was a nice change of pace to actually get out of the truck. Because my wife is on me that... I'm one of these guys, I'm point A to point B. I don't like to stop. You know, in between, I'm like strictly, I load, bam, I go. I stop only for fuel, shower, and that's pretty much it. Or the 30 minute breaks. If I can't make it to the truck stops for fuel to do it. She knows I'm not one that likes to, to stop for anything. She's like, stop, do it. So, I thought it was good. It was a nice distraction to get out of this truck. I really enjoyed that. Because in my years that I've been here at Status, I've only stopped one, twice. And that was on that one trip going out to Oregon, where I filmed me at that one rest area, and then at that river canyon. 
So that's the only other time that I've ever stopped to actually get out of this truck to do something. Besides, you know, drop a trailer of trucks up and go to Walmart. So yes, it was a nice distraction. Um, pleasant guy to meet. So hey, I thought it was awesome that, you know, he emailed me, hey, call me. Call me, he'd come right up there and pick me up. He was there within like 10 minutes and picked me up and took me back to the house and met his wife and his son. So hey, I thought that was a pleasure, y'all. Um, so if you're not subscribed to this channel, go definitely check him out. I guess I'm gonna come back here and lay back down for another hour. Like I say, I can't get up late for about another hour and a half. I just wanna check to see if this truck was still parked right here. I thought it was cool. He was here, but then before I actually went to bed, I looked out and I saw that this guy had moved. Which I guess, you know, put his trailer into the wind instead of against the wind here sideways so he wouldn't rock and tip over. So I thought that was pretty smart. Just hope he can get the trailer out <laughs> when he gets ready to leave. Anyway, y'all, I'm going back to bed and then we'll get up and we'll get rolling a little bit. Peace out. Now that it's light, now you can see how steady the wind is blowing. Look at these reeds. This Werner, he came off the road. And look, he's even back in front of this guy backed his trailer off so that he's kind of going into the wind so his trailer's not sideways like mine where I'm being rocked and blown because I'm setting up the ramp like you're supposed to be. So it's rocking me good, but even the Warner, he's like, bunk this. He's like, I'm putting my freaking trailer in the grass trying to go into the wind. <laughs> this is sad. But, hey, they're running. A shame thinks something new under sun mm. You can't take back some things you already done done No You blame things that you do on somebody else mm. No But they all see But they all see is you need help gave me permission to record them so hey we're getting them on here like i say this is the blue beacon here in salt lake city so hey get them on there they do a good job done a good job on the truck truck's nice and clean so hey like i say they gave me permission to record so hey we're gonna get a little recording up in here so it's all good but yeah as y'all can see this truck and trailer looks much better than what it did a while ago. There's a big difference in how this thing looks. So yeah. Sweet. But as y'all can see, it is much cleaner, much better. Like I say, they don't mind us recording. Let's see, we'll check down here. I know this. Road grind. Ugh. But yeah, y'all look at the rim. Everything looks so much better. So much better than what it is. So yeah. Yeah, y'all, they actually... I got in trouble one time with a blue beacon. They told me, do not record. They got on to me. But the guy's like, hey, man, y'all to put us on your channel. I'm like, so I got permission to record. Like, the one, I said, one blue beacon, they all say crap because I don't record. So he's like, yeah, man, put us on your channel, man. I'm like, hey, okay, I'll record. But we are. We're going to throw this out there on the next video, y'all. Peace out. You waste all of your time.
real time Covering up your tracks Spend all your days running away Now you gotta watch your back And that's the past You spend so much of your life scheming And trying to get over Got you wondering why you come around All you get is cold show uh -huh. 